Today is February 19th. I'm Taylor Hernandez. Vanessa Bennett will have your first morning forecast in just a minute. But first up, here's your news to go. A safety alert for St. Lucie County this morning. People who live on North Hutchinson Island and use Fort Pierce utilities are on a boil water notice. Water was restored yesterday after a main water line break. Until Wednesday, those impacted will have to boil their water before drinking or cooking for one minute. St. Lucie County teachers and district support staff are getting one time bonuses. New teachers can get up to $225. Teachers with more than 15 years of experience can get up to $850. Meanwhile, support staff and non instructional teachers will get a bonus between $150 to $300, depending on hourly wage. The district and school employee unions reached agreements for the one time bonuses last month. And the Artie Gras Fine Arts Festival continues in Palm Beach County today. Several members of our WPBF family were there yesterday to celebrate, including first morning meteorologist Glenn Glazer and Sandra Shaw. Anchors Nathalie Pozo, Stephen Graves and Tiffany Kenny, as well as sports anchor Yanni Caracas will be out there. They were out there yesterday rather having a blast. The outdoor festival features fine art along with live entertainment, artist demonstrated demonstrations and activities for all ages. Vanessa? And it's going to be a really warm week out there. Temperatures will be in the mid to upper 80s um, starting today and even on your um, Monday. So overall, we're going to see those um, temperatures climbing into the low to mid 80s. As we head into the afternoon hours, mid 80s on your Monday, morning lows will be in the 60s and dry weather all week long. Good news, it will stay dry starting tomorrow. Today, just a couple of like showers in the forecast and that's your news to go.